And my habit, you have to keep the clock on me, so. Okay. <laughs> my first poem I'd like to share, Immortal Refugee. You cannot kill me because I'm dying every day. Can you not see it in the news? I am counted, declared collateral damage, and most times not mentioned at all. I am forgotten soon after the memorable, brilliantly colored commercial breaks. You cannot make me bleed again. I have no blood left in me. My innocent blood blanketing streets like wet sidewalks after the rain. You cannot stab my flesh. It's withering away from hunger and thirst, cold and heat, waiting at your fenced army guarded borders. Even my unborn child didn't want to breathe the cruel air I breathe. You cannot cut my skin. It's already cut up, divided, stretched to its limits to every corner of this earth. You cannot cut my skin. Barbed wire has already done what you intended it to do, protect you from my innocence. You cannot suffocate me. I have already drowned, washed up on shores, eaten by sea creatures. I no longer need flotation device or my boat. My life jacket is washed up on shores. My boat is sunken, and I am at the bottom of a deep sea. I do not breathe air anymore, so you cannot suffocate me. You cannot break my bones. Who is able to break bones buried in mass graves, graves that may never be discovered? You cannot make me cry. My tears have overflown and flooded lands, hoping it will heal. But it was never enough. I no longer cry. You cannot crush my spirit. It is eternally wandering, searching searching for peace and security. Everyone is talking about searching for God. The promise to never leave nor forsake me. You cannot kill me because poets of this world know about me. I am the immortal refugee.